So to kick my hair cut off, I'm gonna be spinning my client in the full 360 just so you guys can see the canvas I'm gonna be working on today. Right here, I like to go in and set my first initial guideline with my wall heroes. And I like to set it an inch above the top of the ear. I just like to give myself some type of fade room so I kind of know what I'm working with when I'm going to be blending out or when I'm going to be using the shaver. I'm going to give myself a lot of room so I don't create too harsh of guidelines, if you get what I mean. So as you guys can see, I'm setting the guideline pretty harsh. Remember, whatever you put that guideline in with is what you got to take it out with. So as you guys can see, like... um. We just getting this thing contour all the way to the head, but I want to give a huge shout out to the fans because we almost at that 100k, and y'all don't know how appreciative I am. Like I got so many new things, I done joined up with new groups. Like people don't even understand. It's all gonna come out on my 100k special video. I'ma tell you guys what's all been going on. I'ma show y'all a clip or two of graduation. Like I'ma just give y'all a little bit of this, a little bit of that, just to thank you for 100k. I'm not supposed to be here, so I appreciate this. Right here I go in with my babyless FX. 880s and that's the lever fully open and I like to give myself at least another inch and I like to go up and create my second initial guideline then this is a closed lever and as you guys can see the edits is smoke like shout out to me for the edits uh, I've been doing some new things man and just editing just doing the editing every once in a blue moon just so I can get more comfortable for my promo videos if you watch my promo videos y'all know I like to do a bunch of edits to the songs flicker effects beats shaking the screen I like to do it all so uh, if you ever get a chance man go hit my IG at get underscore beam then go look at these haircut promos I actually drop a promo before the real video come out but as you guys can see I'm just opening and closing literally between this I started off fully open then I started off closed then I went halfway and start fading in between as you guys can see the fade comes together very well you don't have to do all five notches to these things to get the perfect fade you can always stick to your clothes halfway and open and get your fade how you want to as you guys can see I'm bouncing around all through this fade and I just go in with my wall heroes at the end and I like to debulk or knock out the ball Line. This completely knocks it out. Remember what I said. Whatever you put the guideline in with is what you take it out with. See, y'all know what time it is. Hashtag TBT. It's the Beam Team. We get money right now. So uh, I want to just hop back into that 100K, man. Like, I can't believe it's around the corner. Like, it's been two hard works of dedication, man. I really, 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 really appreciate that. So I just go all the way around the head and just repeat the same steps fully open. I kind of wanted to switch my clippers because the wall coilers clips do this way quicker. But as you guys can see, I went open, I closed it, and then I'm going halfway and literally opening my lever the more I go higher in the fade. But I'm not fading in one strip like just the back. I'm literally fading in sections. I started with the right side, hit the middle, and then I'm going to the left now. It's just easier to fade like that for me. You knock it out in smaller sections. But the fade is coming together very well. And shout out to my boy Mac for this beat, man. My boy hit the Air Force. He won't be back till like Aprilish or May. So I'm really appreciating these beats that this man came with, man. Shout out to Omnisphere. Any of the producers who use Omnisphere, shout out to it. Because my boy using it and it's smoke. But I just repeat the same steps, but I do it with the wall coilless magic clips. As you guys see me go open, close, halfway, and then just slowly opening and closing in between. As you guys can see, my fade just came together that quick. That's my favorite part about the man bun. These things keep us humble enough to always remember where we come from, and that's fading. So right here I go in with a number one guard, which is a one eighth guard, and that's fully open just to debulk the top, so I can get this fade to blend perfectly in. Some people normally do like a one and a half or a one. Average height for me is like a one, but I go in close right here, and I just hit the bottom of that guy line. You finna see me open up my clipper a little bit more, just so I can push my guy line a little higher. As you see me do it right there, I'm literally fully open, and then I just drop back down. And as you guys can see, it's literally your level play. Right here is a zero guard, and it's a halfway close. I mean, you just go right in, and you just flick clean out. You open it up the higher you go in the fade, as you guys can see right here. And then you close it the lower you go. As you guys can see, I'm practically fully closed right now. 
and it's still not doing as much for me. So I'm gonna take this guard off and I'm gonna open my clippers up and I'm gonna hit with the corners of my blade. That's how I'm gonna get the fade right in the bag. So I repeat the same steps on the back of the head as well and I like to go in with the one eighth guard fully closed and I like to open it up against the grain and that's how I go ahead and just knock and debulk this hair just so I can get it ready for the fade. These YouTube videos, man, these YouTube videos are getting better. This content is getting better. These beats are getting better. These edits are getting better. Like, I just feel it. Like, 2018 is crazy already. Like, and we ain't been in this year a whole month. We coming with smoke already. I want to give a huge shout out to everybody who liked my last video, man. The Headline Resurrection, man. That video does and is doing very well. Right here, I go in with my modified slim lines by the Barbers. One of the dopest in the game to do it. She literally respond the same day and almost had your product shipped out the same day. My wall heroes and my Andis uh, slim line modified were both done by her. She get these blades perfect and she's on time, man. And she shipped these things out and you have them like literally within a three, four day span with her. It's been times I put in orders with her where I had the product literally the next day. So I just want to give a huge shout out to Veronica. Please go shop with her. And I can't wait for y'all to see what these heroes do on the front of the line. And so y'all can really see that this lady is really with it on these clippers. Right here, I'm just basically stressing, stretching my design out just so I can make it better for me. Like I told you, I really can't explain this design thing. Like I don't do this at all. So uh, when you step out your comfort zone, you just got to be locked in and you just got to be able to do it. So um, that's all I'm doing. I'm just doing I'm like I'm just doing. If I make a mistake, I make a mistake. I'm not a perfect barber, but you got to understand that when you're stepping out your comfort zone, you have to go in with the mentality of you wanting to be a professional barber. Not that can I do this or may I be able to do this. You just go in and you do it. Sometimes you're going to surprise yourself way more than you're going to disappoint yourself. So, um, it's all a confidence thing, man. So, I just basically debulked the front of the line so I can prep it for these heroes. And you see these heroes is hitting. Like, what else do I have to say? Like, I shouldn't have to say Veronica name as much in the video, man. These clippers are smoke. So, please visit her IG, The Barbers. As you guys can see, if you go visit it, she can make any liner hit from Style Liner 2s to Wall Heroes to Wall Detailers to Andis T Outliners to like just to the unknown. Like, she can just set and sharpen any blade, man. And they don't come too sharp, they come perfect. So, I'm gonna give a huge shout out to Veronica again, aka The Barbers. Please visit her channel, man. Please go get something. And her, she's not pricey. She's more than fair. Remember, when you invest in yourself, if y'all in these comments crying about $100, $150, $200, then maybe this ain't the profession for you. Because we'll sit down and we'll spend this $120 or this $150 on some liners. And then we'll flip that in five or six haircuts at $40 a piece. You take minor L's for major comebacks and major W's. So I go in with my kiss and my alcohol. And uh, I told y'all, I'm going to put it in every video. It's 60% kiss, 40% alcohol. You can mix this in the reservoir for the uh, enhancement. Or you can mix it in a cup. It's just whichever one you want to. Everybody keep DMing me on how to mix it. And it's not about how you mix it. Once you got the ratio, that's it. You don't have to know how to mix this. Just have it 60% kiss, 40% alcohol, you'll be straight. And right here, I just like to go in with fibers and I add them to my design because they're easier to move. And it's, it's, it's just easier. Like if I went in with kiss, I would have to be so much more careful. This haircut would take probably five plus more minutes just trying to lay down kiss on a design. So you go in with fibers because fibers go stick everywhere. And then they go move too, depending on how you go in. You just lay it down. And then you go in with spritz over it And you just go back in with your liners And just retouch it as if you was doing it to a liner And everything just becomes so much easier for you As you guys can see We getting this design real right Just stretching it out in certain places And just doing some clean up work
And then I just go in with my Easy Blade for ten percent off of any purchase you make from the Easy Blade store. Use my promo code Get Beamed. And I just go in and I just stretch the skin and I just pull everything back to the line. And as you guys can see, like this beard kind of started off kind of rough. But watch how I get this thing all the way together. Like this is for YouTube. This is for my YouTube fam. So I'm always in a bag when it comes to y'all. I have to show y'all. I have to show y'all. Like y'all need this. Um, and please, if you are subscribed or new to my channel, Please subscribe and hit that notification bell just so you guys can get alerted when I drop a new video. Uh, I really feel like um, my videos are not getting out there. I just feel like it's a problem with YouTube. So um, if you guys can just hit that bell, I'll be way more appreciative, man. I just want y'all to be able to get these videos so you guys can view it, man. And then uh, we'll be straight. But as you guys can see, man, I got that beard all the way together. All it is is repetition. You just got to just keep doing it. Just keep doing it. Just because you go over the beard one time don't mean it's done. Just keep doing it. Repetition is key in this game. The more you do something, the more comfortable you get. The sharper it is. The cleaner it is. As you guys can see, you stretch the skin and you pull everything back. And that's how you get these liners that crazy. As you guys can see me just redoing everything. Even if I did it once, I'm going to brush it off and I'm going to do it again. You want to make sure that this thing is there. You want them 90 degree angles. You want that hard right angle for them corners. Right here, you just got to finish strong with them shavers. But look at the edits, man. Hashtag TBT. Y'all know what time it is. As you guys can see, this haircut going to look good with or without the design. I just hit the shavers at the bottom instead of early so I don't set my guy line too high. Just something comfortable for me, but let's see what he think. Yeah, but that's stable. Let's work, man. Y'all know what time it is. Hashtag TBT. It's the big team. So this was the haircut on just how to do the samurai man bun with a design part. I appreciate all of you guys stopping through and watching. So I want to give a huge thanks to everybody. Uh, if you could please like, share, and subscribe to see more videos. Other than that, may God bless.